Brought to you by Phillips 66 Aviation and by the Bose Headset 10. With over 700 FBOs nationwide and the strongest supply in the industry, it's no wonder Phillips 66 is aviation's number one fuel provider. Phillips 66, the most trusted wings in aviation. I'm Larry Anglisano reporting for AvWeb at Sun and Fun 2010, and I'm sitting inside the workhorse of general aviation. It's a Piper Navajo, a cabin class piston twin that went out of production in the 80s. But you can have a new Piper Navajo with the lock and key modification by Mike Jones Aircraft. And here's Mike to give us some more information. A lock and key Navajo is a concept I came up with approximately seven years ago. There's a classic aircraft called the Piper Navajo that went out of production in the mid 80s. It was one of the best aircraft Piper ever built. It was a cabin class, multi-engine airplane. And that aircraft would carry approximately 1,050 pounds after full fuel. So I thought if I could take this airplane and renovate it to like new standards, it would kind of go in competition with uh, similar aircraft out there in the market that are not in production and that are in production. And so it, it was really the missing link in the uh, aviation market for a cabin class, multi-engine, twin-engine aircraft. Over the stock Navajo, the main program that we're trying to implement in this whole process is that we're gonna start the airplane out with everything on that airplane working as good or better than the factory, down to the smallest light bulb. That takes uh, approximately, after we renovate the airplane, approximately four to six months, we uh, actually fly the airplane 15 to 30 hours, working the squawks out, working the leaks out, and uh, providing a customer with an aircraft squawk free the day they pick it up. Uh, on the aircraft, we start out with a standard lock and key is a Garmin package, uh, WASH 530, 430, 340 audio panel, uh, Avidyne multifunction display, and that is what we have in our standard lock and key. Then we have an option list that you can add to that. We have typically a KFC 200 autopilot or equivalent, pretty well stocked from 79 on up. Use as an option. Uh, a customer can elect to put the Garmin 600 in the aircraft. The paint interior is, uh, is, is equivalent to brand new paint when we get done with it. We do approximately a $40,000, $45,000 paint job, $40,000, $45,000 interior job on the aircraft. Mods to the engines are, uh, we put the J2B engines on it versus the J2BD. The J2BD had a uh, dual mag with a single drive. The J2B has separate mags, separate drives. Uh, the four blade props, uh, and which uh, really quietens the airplane down substantially. It's actually scary how quiet the aircraft becomes once we put those on there. And that's uh, STC, about another provider that we use. And we also put uh, winglets on the aircraft, and which really helps the airplane. It's like a two feet of uh, wing on the aircraft and uh, gives it approximately 6% climb performance. To date, we've done nine aircraft. We're approximately working on number 10 right now. We're working on this aircraft for a customer from uh, Missouri. They presently have a Hawker 900, and this is going to be an aircraft they're going to use for their three, four, 500 mile trips. What we're typically geared up, purchasing the aircraft ourselves, doing a complete package for the customer, but we will do uh, a customer service as we bring the aircraft in, and we'll do the complete renovation there on their particular aircraft. The Bose Aviation Headset 10 voted number one for the ninth consecutive year in Professional Pilots' 2009 Annual Headset Preference Survey. Today's Aviation Headset 10 delivers a highly acclaimed combination of noise reduction, clearer audio, and comfort that remains unmatched. Learn more at Bose.com headset.